Oh, we didn't get all of them. I remember there being one with the stuffed nug that we did we haven't done that one yet. Where'd that one where's that one at? Was that one up here? I know we didn't go up here, so it might have been our mistake. Hang on. We need to correct this mistake. I guess Fear Demon can wait a minute. He's been here for a while. He's getting he's in a rush. Alright, look, another pride demon. Two pride demons, oh. Nugget. All right. All right, here you go, little fella. There you go. We got all of them now. And now we can head back. Nope, here we are. This is what we want. Thank you guys. Off you go. She's, she's floating and T-posing. Which one is the nightmare? Please tell Liliana. I am sorry. I failed you too. Hey, Solus, can you tell us what the fuck she just did? Well, that was kind of a wasted move. I grow fat on your fear. In war victory! In duty, vigilance. In war, sacrifice. Nothing. Really? Because we're kind of we're kind of working our way through you pretty easily. Goodbye. Wait, where's the where home did you go? Where, where's the at? Ah, oh, there he is. Floating around, being creepy. Almost got him, almost got him. He's shielded again, lovely. You cannot stand against me. You wanna bet? Do a good job of it right now. Where's the end now? You will die in agony. Yeah, I don't know about that. And dead.
Oh shit, another big one's back. We need to clear a path. Go. I'll cover you. No, you were right. The Grey Wardens caused this. A warden must. A warden must help them rebuild. That's your job. Corypheus is mine. We're not sacrificing Hawk, are you kidding me? No, Stroud stays. Stroud. You have someone to return to, Hawk. It has been an honor. For the water. This means so much more when you have it when you have it be uh when it's um a low gain. Hello. Fucking die so fast. Whereas Logan just feels so much more impactful, like it's him, you know, one final sacrifice. Look how she was posing. All victorious and shit. She was right. Without the nightmare to control them, the mages are free. And Corypheus loses his demon army. Though as far as they're all concerned, the Inquisitor broke the spell with the blessing of the Maker. They came out of this alive. As far as I'm concerned, they can tell whatever stories they like. I suppose you're right. Inquisitor, the Archdemon flew off as soon as you disappeared. The Venatori Magister is unconscious but alive. Cullen thought you might wish to deal with him yourself. Oh, I most certainly do. Wardens, those who weren't corrupted helped us fight the demons. We stand ready to help make up for Clarell's tragic mistake. Where is Stroud? He's very, very dead. Warden Stroud died striking a blow against a servant of the Blight. We will honor his sacrifice. And remember how he exemplified the ideals of the Grey Wardens. Even as Corypheus and his servants tried to destroy you all from within. Inquisitor, we have no one left of any significant rank. What do we do now? I'm not gonna banish them now. You stay and do whatever you can to help. Stroud died for the ideals of the Wardens. In war, victory. And we are still at war. Do you believe the Wardens can still help? I do, Your Worship. You're still vulnerable to Corypheus and possibly his Venatori. But there are plenty of demons that need killing. <sighs> Shut up, Solus. You give them yet another chance? Yes. I'll, do that. I'll inform the Wardens at Weishaupt what's happened. Best they not get caught off guard. Thank you, Your Worship. We will not fail you. They're misguided and given and taken advantage of. Now I'm going to give them a better purpose. Good luck, Inquisitor. It's been an honor. And take care of Varric for me. Oh, look, more achievements. Cool. Send you one final report. He's on his way to Weishaupt. As for the Grey Wardens, they are fighting demons in Red Templars while staying clear of Venatori. You dealt Corypheus a significant blow, Inquisitor. The Grey Wardens carry yeah, make the most of it, right? Nations. If we spread word that the Inquisition has their support, we may gain standing with nations that have suffered under the blight. I will take the matter to Josephine. While you bested Corypheus here and at Halam Shiral, he himself was not present either time. We fear he is close to finding another way to enter the Fade. When you have a moment, Colin and Josephine are waiting in the war room with an update. What was she like? Divine Justinia, our soul. 
or the spirit that took her form. I read your report. I know it isn't clear, but... You know, I would hope you would read my report. You're like directly underneath me. I need you to read them. Calm. Serene even. And she guided us the whole way through. That does sound like her. She did ask me to tell you something, though. She said, I'm sorry. I failed you, too. Oh. I should finish this before it slips my mind. Perhaps later we might discuss the matter further. Thank you. Bye. Get my level up too. Okay, so we can't talk to her right now for obvious reasons. Someone's been doing some training as an assassin, no less. Steals are useful. I mean, hey, that one skill was fucking goaded. I should say, with the amount of killing you do, a bit of flair is a fine thing. I don't kill that many people. Are you joking? I'm only surprised you didn't kill someone walking over here. At any rate, if you ever intend to make it an actual profession, do tell me. The Antiven Crows have nothing on the Imperium. I know people. Keep it in mind. I should go. Try not to die. I would notice you were gone. Always with the questions. What will people say? Yeah, okay, moving on. Naturally. Cullen! Are you ready for my love yet? Oh. Ryland's men will monitor the situation. Yes, sir. We'll begin preparations at once. In the meantime, we'll send soldiers to... ...assist with the relief effort. That will be all. Sir. So Lock it while you're at it. More, isn't there? Wishing we were somewhere else? I barely found time to get away before. This war won't last forever. When it started, I... I hadn't considered much beyond our survival. But things are different now. What do you mean? I find myself wondering what will happen after. When this is over, I... I won't want to move on. Not from you. If we can stay together. We don't gotta separate. I, I don't know what you... That is, if you... Uh... Why would friend... Why would I have friends on him now? Cullen, do you need to ask? I am... Um, fairly certain we're about to see a nipple. <laughs> Oh, on the desk? Oh. Oh, no nipple? Okay, good. No, Cassandra sees a nipple, okay. Leave me. Leave me. Bad dream. They always are. Without Lyrian. I didn't mean to worry you. You can let me worry about you a little. <laughs> Where are we? Why is there so much echo? You are... Oh, I have never felt anything like this. I love you. You know that, right? I love you too.
Look at this man, he's a golden Adonis. Good to see you. That's all for now. Another time, then. Yeah, let's go talk to Solus now. We got oh, the door's locked. He did lock the door. Let's go talk to Solus and you know calm him down. Actually, no. Let's go do the sitting in judgment first, then we'll go talk to Solus. Gotta go and calm him down now, could be kind of, you know, upset him a lot when we let the warden stay. We reached the climax. No, oh, Barrack's back. Adamant's influence continues, your worship. I submit Lord Livius Erimond of Virantium, who remains loyal to Corypheus. We found him alive, offering extreme resistance, likely because the Order will ask for his head. In more colorful terms. To say nothing of justice you might personally require for what was suffered in the faith. Yep, a life for a life. Many places felt the pain of adamant. You will answer for a great deal. I recognize none of this proceeding. You have no authority to judge me. I have all the authority. I'm the, inquis I'm the Inquisitor. Many officials have communicated that they will defer to the Inquisitor on this matter. Because they fear, not just Corypheus, but Tevinter, rightful ruler of every piece of ground ye trod in your pathetic life. I serve the living God. Bring down your blades and free me from the physical. Glory awaits me. Say less. Lord Eremond, any protection you thought you had has apparently been withdrawn. You will die. You're about to be an open seat on the Magisterium. Again. Actions. Truth lies in the next world. Two Magisters, ooh. Alright, that's that taken care of. Now you gotta clean it first. Oh. We have another one now. Another of the lingering pains of Adamant, your worship. Sir Ruth is a senior warden of the Order. She was one of the many who slit the throat of another to bind a demon. She does not contest this. In fact, she surrendered to us. She requests no mercy. She wants the public justice of the headman's axe. You're very serious about this. Is more death the answer? There is no excuse in my actions. I murdered another of the Order. That blood marks me more than the Blight ever could. Accepting their actions while thralls of Corypheus, Many treaties allow wardens any extreme if it opposes the blight. I can't do it. I can't use the greater good to justify my crimes. As if it would create a future I could be a part of. It is wrong that this broke me. I've done worse with full sanction. I can do nothing except be an example of the cost. To the deep roads you go. You feel your life is over? There's a place for such wardens. Sir Ruth, you'll go to the deep roads. Your death may be as quick as you choose. This sends no message. This is just... an end. All right, now we go talk to Solus. <laughs> Calm him down a little bit. I cannot believe the Grey Wardens 
could even conceive of such a plan. To seek out these old gods deliberately in some bizarre attempt to preempt the blight. Grey Wardens have always been dangerous. They care for nothing beyond stopping the Darkspawn. Like a fair maiden chasing a butterfly off a cliff. Except that if you hadn't stopped them, we'd all have fallen. Both fools and duty. Responsibility is not expertise. Action is not inherently superior to inaction. Forgive me. The entire idea is... unnerving. Good afternoon. Alright, let's work on getting your approval back up. I'd like to hear more about what you saw in your exploration of the Fade. I would be happy to share it with you. Tell me about the old ruins you explored. I found the ruin of Baron Dua, a lost Tevinta city buried deep beneath the dead and barren wasteland. Volcanic ash had sealed it tight. In one dark moment, every living creature in the city seared and smothered. They were statues in the ashes, like a mold made to recall the lost. Tell me about a spirit you encountered. I met a friendly spirit who observed the dreams of village girls as love first blossomed in their adolescence. With subsidy, Sounds a little bit creepy, but okay. Boys with gentle hearts, who would return their love with gentle kindness. The matchmaker, so I called her. That small village never knew its luck. Tell me about the old memories you found in the Fade. I saw a savage human horde go marching toward the battlefront. They sang a soldier's hymn to keep formation. Primal music shook the ground. These savage, unwashed warriors carried harmonies no chantry choirs mastered. Though their cause was all but hopeless, they sang songs that made the spirits weep. We'll talk later. Goodbye. Varric, how you doing, buddy? Hi, bud. I knew Stroud, you know, not well. He led the wardens near Kirkwall. Not many people knew who he was, but the man was a hero when it mattered. He wasn't the first good man to fall to Corypheus. He won't be the last. His story's no good for heroes. We're taking down Corypheus before he takes any more lives. You know, some yeah, have some confidence there. Shit like that, I almost start to believe it. Oh, Hawk asked me to tell everyone back in Kirkwall where he's going. I'll have to let Merrill know. I had better write some letters. Excuse me. Sorry, I really need to write some letters. Another time, all right? Alrighty then. Later it is, I guess. Part of Sarah, uh, Cassandra. Writing does not come naturally to me, as I'm certain you can imagine. Let's play with her a bit. You're composing a love poem. I couldn't, not even if my life depended on it. It's not that hard. Yes, it is. Poetry takes finesse. It takes grace. You don't think you have those things? It takes a different Dorians kind of finesse and grace. What happened at Adamant Fortress in the Fade. I was there. I saw it with my own eyes. It must be recorded. That's an excellent idea, Cassandra. I certainly thought so until I started writing. Maybe go talk to Varric, have him pen it for you while you describe it to him. I still don't know what to say about the spirit of the Divine. I saw her there, heard her voice, yet I cannot claim with certainty it was really her. The Chantry teaches us that the souls of the dead pass through the Fade, so it could have been her, yet even so. Do you really think it might have been her? A ghost? A ghost? A remnant of her hopes and memories. An echo. A lingering will to do good. Those things are all possible. 
Nobody knows for certain what happens after we die. A spirit could have assumed her form, but why? It helps you, as Justinia herself would have. The spirit, nothing more. I believe it was her. Maybe it doesn't matter. Perhaps it doesn't matter what she really was then. It matters to me, to what I must write. I must interpret what I saw, yet I am no priest, no philosopher. I am a warrior. Sure, I believe it was her. I believe it was the divine. She helped us one last time. You're fancying me for best stories. I that's true. I want to believe it. When I realized we were physically in the phase, I was terrified, almost beyond reason. The last time such a thing happened, we created Darkspawn. We created Corypheus. The world needs to know the truth this time. No more legends lost to the ages. Anything else we can talk to her about? What do you need, my friend? Not much. That's enough for now. Another time, then. Hey, Krem. Commander Cullen did good work at Adamant. Breached those walls like he'd done it a dozen times. Nice job with the demons, by the way. Can you think of any other tasks suitable for the Chargers? You sealed the main rift at Adamant, but the fortress is still a mess. Demons, darkspawn, Megan knows what. I could take Rocky out there with some of the boys. They know how to bring down walls. We can't close rifts, but we can bury the bastards under a ton of rubble. So I'll take a plan then. Talk later. Hey, Bull. Oh. oh what's going on here? <laughs> okay. Again. Uh, come on. This is why the Kuhn doesn't like women fighting. I should have asked Cullen. Uh, good one. What are we doing to Bull? Perhaps you can take over. Gunari training exercise to master your fear. I heard about the nightmare at Adamant. Sounded big. Can you explain why I'm supposed to hit you with this stick? Probably, if I try. It'd involve a lot of Kunari words, though. Just hit me with the stick, all right? I need to get over this demon crap. You weren't even there. All right. There we go. Oh, yeah. Damn demon. Who's stuck in the fade, huh? Get all your system, buddy. You fought in that siege. Every demon at Adamant wanted to tear you in half. I bet, you demon assholes. And who killed you? That's right. I on fucking ball. Oh. I needed that. Thanks, boss. Anytime. Anytime. Hello, bull. Such a, such a crazy guy. Anything else? How are you? Never mind. If we're done with you. You happier with the champion off with the wardens? There were wardens in Kirkwall 